Okay, we're going to show you our hotel that we're staying at in Bangkok. It's called the 56 Hotel, uh, and what we've seen it so far, very happy with it, so would recommend. Um, start in the bathroom, it's a lovely bathroom. Classic sink, toilet, shower, and it is amazing. Very nice, not quite full wet room, which is quite nice for a change. And into the room, nice desk, do a bit of work if you want. Um, massive bed, probably the biggest bed we've had so far, isn't it? Huge. Mm -hmm. And then we've got a little balcony. No chairs out there to sit on, but yeah, nice. Uh, looking over the main street over there. Um, so yeah, good aircon, TV, really nice there. How much did it cost? Um, so we're here for a week. It costs one hundred and seventy pounds for seven nights. It's pretty reasonable. This is the pool area, which is gorgeous. Nice bit of sunlight, and there's Jack in the gym. <laughs> What have we got here, Sophie? We've got crispy pork um, and rice. Oh, is it good? It's amazing. I feel like they're not going to believe us because everything's amazing. But yeah, we've obviously now come to Thailand, so we're on a different um, currency. They're a bit of a kick to them. Yeah. So this was um, eight, 80 Thai baht, which I'll have a go know, again. Um, I think it's I think it's just under two pounds, which is pretty good, isn't it? It tastes amazing. It's like crispy on the outside, soft on the inside. Amazing. And then we got some amazing gyozas chicken. So he's got another wild uh, ice cream. I'm excited. Thank you. Oh wow. What toppings are you going to go for? I don't think we can do it for any I'm very happy with it. Okay. Thank you. We've had a very sad turn of events. So, so excited eating her ice cream. You'll see I've got it now. And unfortunately, she had one look at the ice cream and realised that this ice cream is coconut based. And I'm allergic to coconut. So allergic to coconut. So we did weigh up the options, whether it was worth the risk, and we decided probably not because Jack's not very good at first aid, so. Yeah. So I know this looks like it's worked out well for me, but I'm actually not really that bothered about this ice cream or any ice cream. He doesn't know. deserve the ice cream. He doesn't but get excited. it's either I eat it or it just goes to waste. So Jack's ended up with the ice cream. Thankfully, I managed to savour a few flakes and avoided what could have been a nasty. Uh, I mean, as, much, as far turn. as I like ice cream, it, is, it tastes quite nice actually. Oh, good. Good. Carry on. Right, we haven't done much talking today, have we? So today's been a travel day. As you've seen a few clips, but we haven't really talked to you that much, so. I'll tell you what we've done. So, we got the plane from Bangkawi. It took a night. But it took. And we then. We weren't even in the air for like 15 minutes, I don't think. No. It, it was so fast. So fast. Then, um, we had about a two hour wait in the airport in Penang. Which wasn't great, actually. There's, there was nothing to do in there. No. It? It's quite a small airport. Um, as you'll see, we didn't really do much, did we, other than try and spend the money we had. Just mm, for Had little rubbish chair massages. Um, anyway, then we flew from Penang to Bangkok. 
this was about a two hour flight. Pretty much all on time, which is good, no complaints with, with that. And then once we got to Bangkok, we got a grab, which came pretty quickly as well. Um, took about 45 minutes in the grab because the traffic was busy to our hotel. So, um, and then this evening, after we checked in, we've obviously been down to a local like night market kind of thing. Um, we basically just saw that it was recommended in the hotel lobby, so we just thought tonight, why not? We've had a busy day traveling, 10 minute walk away from the hotel, and it was pretty good, wasn't it? Yeah, lovely. We had a nice bit of food and some ice cream, which I'm gonna have to eat now because it is melting. Um, but that's what we've done today. So um, let's see what so Bangkok has in store for us. Right, so what have we got for breakfast today? Um, for breakfast today we went to a little French bakery it's called Bonjour. Yeah, it was amazing, wasn't it? Just like, yeah. like loads of different pastries. Yeah. And, just and crazy breakfast. tea. Yeah, so we've got... So we've got a little array of croissants actually. Actually, might be dinner. We've got some like, little muffins. We've got, I think that's chocolate and custard. Thing, yeah. And... We've got a little... That's amazing, isn't it? We've got like two pastries each and a couple of muffins. And that's all come to? £2.13. No, oh. £2.57. £2.57. <laughs> and then we got our boosts as usual, which again Love is it. about yeah. £2.10, £2.20 here. Yeah, it's good, it's good. Hello. So, uh, you saw us at breakfast this morning. Um, we've actually this afternoon just had a bit of a rest, haven't we? Um, yeah. It's obviously been a busy few weeks and I think it's just caught up with us a little bit. So um, we just took the afternoon just to relax at the hotel, have a little nap. Um, but we feel better now and we're heading out to our first night market at Bangkok, mm -hmm. which is called the Train Night Market. Uh, I'm not sure what. It's one of the more famous ones. I think so. So yeah, so we're going to have a look around, maybe have a look at some shops and get some dinner. And try and get some ice cream that's edible this evening. Yes, and while we're here, so why don't you show her the lobby of this hotel that we're staying oh, yeah, it's, it's really nice. Gorgeous. So we've arrived at this night market, it's massive I think, but it's really cool isn't it? Yeah. And look what we just stumbled across, some cool vintage cars. So many different stalls as well isn't there, with yeah. like just selling everything. We'll have a look around, but it looks good doesn't it? Yeah. We've gone with some chicken and some beef skewers. This is the chicken. 20p for a skewer. Both of those and the flavour is really nice. Whatever they put on them, really good. I'll show you what the beef one looks like. So you can try that one. Again, looks really good. It's very good. Here Another go. thing I love about Bangkok is they do these massive jugs Coke. of Coke. It's just one bottle, but they just like fill this cup with ice and it's amazing. Very good. Right, so have a bite of this. Mm, yeah. Good. Fantastic. From Kebab Boy. From Kebab Boy. Um, I don't know why I'm speaking the first night. 
Yeah, yeah, it's quite messy, isn't it? But it, it looks good. And the beef looked good, didn't it? Yeah. Go on, have a have a go. Did you get any beef there? No. Right. Come on then. Get some beef. Try so give it. Try so give it a try. You, you give it I think you're going to really like it. The wrapper is a bit difficult to manoeuvre, isn't it? Yeah. It wasn't wrong. It does taste really good. The beef's nice. It's actually got, it's a bit sweet, isn't it, in there? I think it's probably like sweet chilli. Mm. And then some lettuce, a bit of cheese, maybe. Really nice, really nice. what this thing is here the big frame you can yeah. see i have no idea what it was then we found out it's a driving range so guess where we're going this evening and i love golf Look what else is here, they've even got like an army tank vehicle type thing. This place is really cool. It's a really weird mix of like... It is, it, I just didn't expect it. Things. But like look, just like everywhere you look, something's different. There's a garage with a vintage car. Loads of vintage shops here, isn't there? Yeah. Look at all these vehicles. live music and things it's quite cool isn't it Other than they're very tasty. <laughs> 